Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Dragon Age 2. And what the hell were we doing? Man, it has been forever since the last episode. But let's uh, let's just go out into the town and see what's going on. Uh, so we could go do that. Sounds lame. Could go somewhere interesting. Just do herbalist tasks. No, I feel like we're going to have to go out there at some point. So why don't we do Seal of the Old God Dumat? Because I think this was just a random, like, to use uh, Skyrim parlance, like a radiant quest. Everyone should be free, not just mages. Not everyone's dangerous. It's not a bad Yevon? You, this is your fault. You and ah. the blighter, Ferric Tethras. Ah. You're the end of my voice. Have we met? I don't even know who you are. Yep, yeah, pretty much. Member in good standing of the Dwarven Merchants Guild. Okay. Not that it really matters to people like you. What exactly did I do? You'll have to be more specific. A lot of things are my fault. It's true. My sons are lost in the deep roads because of stories about you. Your sodding glory and treasure. Ah, so I'm tangentially at fault. We both know this was Iwin's doing. If you want to keep your job, shut your mouth, woman. Your boys are grown men. It was their own decision. Uh, it's going to require an explanation. What exactly were they trying to do? It may be my fault, Monsieur. I've told them all the stories about you. Wow, that was a quick change You're of the only one change pace. They, went. they were following the path of your expedition. Please help Don't know me. how. Don't let my boys die down there. Just tell me what happened. Your sons made an expedition into the deep roads. Did anyone go with them? They went alone, the fools. I was gonna say, probably not. Every dark spawn in the deep road. Sounds like your children are fucking stupid, to be honest. The whole thing was his idea. Emrys and Merrin were just following his lead. Right. The greedy bastard didn't want to hire anyone else if it meant he had to share the spoils. Sounds familiar. <laughs> yeah. I well. Coming to the surface meant I would never have to face losing my sons to the dark spawn. All right, I'll do it. I'll do everything in my power to bring your sons home. Why do I keep making friends with people who want to spend all their free time <laughs> in the bloody deep roads? Well, thank you, that's fair. Those boys are my life. They entered the deep roads using the same passage you did. Please find them. I will see you rewarded for your efforts. Okay. Seems seems fine. Rivalry with Isabella. Is this because I didn't ask for like money or because I was just helpful? Didn't like extort them. Boland the amateur analyst. This is yours, not oh. Don't worry, I'll keep my hands to myself. Uh ooh. A book. Book. Thank you. Do we have to sell anything? No, we obviously we clearly just sold everything. Uh is that a weapon that was fallen behind? 18 physical attack? I think that was pretty. Uh, ooh, red steel gloves. Ooh, they've got a rune slot. We can't afford them. Not even close. Cobble's blades. What? What do you got? Spear long sword. All full. How much does this do? Twenty one. Okay, so our sword's not actually that bad. Okay. All right. Well, look, we've got a goal. And to be fair, it's probably go out here, right? We just go to the deep roads. Surely, there's only going to be one quest in the deep roads. To be into slavers. Oh, I've caught up with Fenris. I'm like, oh, okay. Like, why am I? When did I piss off Hunters. to into slavers? Aside from Stop in general. Like you are in possession of stolen property. Back away from the slave now, and you'll be spared. Uh, he's not a slave. Fenris is a free man. I won't repeat myself. Back away from the slave now! Well, I am not your slave! Yes, I say, why don't you come down here and get him? Let's see how that goes for you. Uh, it's looking like the answer is not well. Yeah, see, I still remember how to do that. Well, come on, lads. You are in the place you do not want to be. 
Like, you're in the number one place you don't want to be, at the end of Fenris and my two-handed swords and just the splash damage. Oh, okay. Now they're being sneakier. I feel like you guys should just come out a bit sooner. Like, if they had this many people, why not send them all out at once? They might have actually, you know, not exploded like that. <laughs> Ooh. Well, that mage is going to live to regret this. Where is he? Please no, no, you don't hit someone in the face when you're trying to interrogate them. Everything just gets all fuzzy. No, I swear. Adriana brought us... She's at the holding caves north of the city. I can show you the way. No need. I know which one. Oh you God, speak Fenris, your neck. <laughs> let me go. I beg you. I swear. You chose I won't. the wrong master. Yeah, I was gonna say. I feel like he's. Yep, not gonna let you live. Hadriana. I was a fool to think I was free. They'll never let me be. Who's Hadriana? This is someone you know. My old master's apprentice. Oh. I remember her well. A sniveling social climber that would sell her own children if she thought it would please Daenerys. If she's here, it's at his bidding. I knew he wouldn't let this go. Uh, and now they're dead. They're no longer a threat, Fenris. There will be more. If Hadriana's here, she won't stop. We need to find her. We'll send a message to Daenerys he won't soon forget. All right. Lead the way. The holding caves held slaves in the old times, but apparently they are no longer abandoned. Jeez. So, so angry. Before Hadriana has a chance to prepare or flee. Uh, I, I guarantee we won't. Isabella rivalry. Wow, Isabella's just going to hate me. I guess Isabella's like real live and let live, right? She, she doesn't want to get involved in stuff. She, how is her? What does her stat look like? Oh yeah, she's more rival than friend. Oops. That's okay. We'll, we'll pull it back at some point. Maybe Fenris and Isabella is not a, not a power couple like you think it is. Maybe, maybe that's my bad. Ah, oh, just like Varric's so. It's not boring. I was gonna say he's boring. He's not. He's just like a, a bit of a yes man. Like he kind of just always agrees with you. He he yearns for your approval. It is exceptionally hard to get him to hate you by the end of this. Unless you're kind of doing things that are specifically bad. <clears throat> Which you're kind of guided towards not doing. Alright, where are these stupid dwarven children? Do you ever have any regrets? About what? At least the assumption is we shouldn't have to wander through the entire deep roads. It looks like we just have to go here. Although there's probably a little bit more to it than that. I doubt they're all here, right? Yeah, I was gonna say probably just like one of them. Are you one of Yevin's sons? Mistress Hawk? Please help me. Sure. My brother. Marin. I one locked him in with the dark spawn. He sealed the door. Left me here and bolted for that passage. He's gone mad. All he cares about is that damned sword. What sword? Last time I was here, we picked this place clean. What's your brother looking for? Iwan called it the Heart Drinker. He says it's the masterwork of an ancient smith from this Taig. He bought a book from one of the Orzammar caravans. It had the location of the sword. Ew. Or at least to the golems who guard it. Yeah, great. Is anyone truly Is mad? Is brother insane or just cruel? He wouldn't tell us about the sword, but I never imagined he'd leave us to rot. Maybe we should look for this sword. Sounds like you missed the best thing in here. I don't oh, it is true. The sword. Please, save my brother. Uh, oh my god, Isabel's gonna hate me even more. Look, I'll save Marin. Go back to your father and I'll find you when I'm done. We'll get the sword, it's so not going anywhere. Of that wall, you need to find a way to reach him. Please, come tell my father as soon as you have news. 
Yeah. The sword's not going anywhere. It's been here forever. Been, been here for fucking ages. Well, Anders, your spidey sense, pun intended, is needs a bit of work. Because these are not darkspawn, these are spiders. Oh my god, they take so much killing, you forget. There we go. Okay, next one. Oh god, this might actually be a problem. Okay, the poisonous spiders, not as bad. Uh, I take it back, they are resisting most of my hits. Oop, didn't resist those couple. Sundered him, I guess. <sighs> Fenris does a lot more damage than I do. He mopped the floor with that spider when he came over. Okay, was this little trip even worth it? Sash of the Tirashan. Would be good. Ooh, it's a fiver. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Isabel would probably love a sailor's rope belt. No, no actually she would not. She, she could not care less. Uh, yeah. Yeah, no, the ornate belt probably is better. Uh, ooh, attack and physical damage. That sounds like a Fenris thing. Uh, yep. It can go on that one. Boom. Cool. Okay. It was probably worth it. It's not like the spiders actually downed anybody, so we didn't even waste any injury kits. We'll be fine. <laughs> spiders? Oh, is this like... You want Meron? Okay, yeah, gotcha. Oh, okay, I can't go that way. Oh, do I have to go back this way? This is a very confusing map, because, like, that was the thing he was sitting in front of. The thing that's definitely not a door. And yet, right next to it is a door, where he's like, you're gonna have to find a way to get back there. It's like, did you consider the archway two feet to your left? Ow! Ow! I did not see him there. No, six. That's what I wanted. Ah, beautiful Templar. Nice, got him. Alright. Root and toot and let's get to kill him. Ooh. Yeah, I think between me and Fenris, we just wipe out mages. Any sort of mage, doesn't matter. They just die. I had no idea the deep roads would be like this, that the dark spawn would just be everywhere. Why? I've heard the stories, but it's not the same as actually being down here. You're an idiot. The stories weren't made up just to frighten children. These monsters. Hey, what's on the deep roads? Uh, dark spawn, deep stalkers, ancient civilizations, dark spawn, uh, arch demons, dark spawn. Oh wow, I didn't know there'd be dark spawn in this place. Believe he betrayed us. Do you think he's alive? Uh, you need to get to safety. Let's get you out of here before the dark spawn. Don't uh, don't you worry about blank. You let me worry about blank. I can't thank you enough for coming when you did, Messer. You know. I never realized what the dwarves in Orzammar are up against. They fight these monsters every day of their lives. Yeah. I don't think I can sit by and let my people die while I enjoy the easy life of a merchant. Not anymore. Oh. Come find us when you return. I'm sure Father will want to thank you for saving me. You know what? You're an idiot, but you're a brave idiot. Which is kind of not any better or not any worse. You just you just are. Okay, let me go find Yuan. Is he, is he gonna have the sword and we need to kill him? Because he's like a crazy person now. Is that the punishment? I don't really care. Yuan sounds insane. Or stupid. And considering his two brothers are stupid, he's probably stupid. Eh, 
Whatever. We're about to find out. I don't know why they just didn't unlock that door. Terrible game. Zero out of ten. Well, shocker. He's dead. So Iwin is dead. Ooh, gone control, control rod. That must be the golem Neat. Perhaps the creatures it controls are further down this path. Oh, good. That's not a golem. I, I was concerned there for a second. Oh, you're friendly, right? Ah, he is friendly. Neat. Attack Golem. Get him. Wow, he... He did get him. Ah, good thing too, because we do not do a lot of damage. Okay, don't really know what the Super Saiyan charge up did. I guess his his key is charged up now. So that's good. That'll be useful for later. Alright. Next. Yep, you, you popped a bit early. But you know what? Happens to the best of us. I like their synchro. Oh, look at him go. Okay, they finally figured it out. Actually, they don't do a lot of damage either. I feel like we didn't need the golem's help. I think we're... I think we're good. Oh my god, we would have been here forever though. We're basically just waiting for Anders to... cast, like, Winter's Chill or whatever. We didn't have a mage for whatever reason. Good lord. We would actually be here forever. Wow, that did not do much. Well, it gave him stunlocked apparently. I wonder if he's just not hitting Isabella, maybe? I see more dark spawn. Hiya, fellas. Just gonna teleport to you so that I can get this guy. Nice. Oh, that's an ogre. Okay, let's kill the emissary real quick. Thank you. Oh my god, there's just like the gun line in there. Uh, do we deal with the gun line first? I guess. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I'm gonna just be in here. Okay, Fenris dealt with the gun line. Nice. That, that could have been bad. That could have been real bad. I, I think if we targeted the ogre and just got gun line to death, that would have been over very, very quickly. It looks like the dark spot. A lyrium laced bilge. Maybe there's still something to salvage in this mess. Okay. Uh. Oh. Yep. Yeah, yeah, cool. Uh. Trash cache. Oh, oh. Uh. Isabella, you probably can't unlock that, can you? I oh, can. Nice. Zoe's Battered Horde Kickers. Okay. Restricted to me as well. Uh, which I can't actually wear. Because they require Cunning Index. They're... I guess they are kind of better. I don't think it's worth putting a couple of points into Cunning. What, how many do we need? It was like... 12? We mm, could put a couple. I guess that's critical damage. Hmm, it's not really our build. Sword probably would have been nice. I, I bet we would have got the sword if we saved Yuan, but... It's, well, it wasn't the right thing to do, and also, I bet you it wouldn't have been a two-handed sword. It would have been a one-handed, and it was probably restricted to Hawk as well. 
So I don't I don't think it would have been that that impactful to be completely honest. Uh Okay, we're doing that. Barrack. Right. So in your office. Hangman's pub, Hightown Mansion. Okay. Side quests. Ah, Forbidden Knowledge. That's the one I was thinking of. Uh, faintly glowing support ring for a cask used in the creation of suspect liquors, only palatable to dwarves and usually regarded as poisons by the guard. That narrows the hoop's origins to Dark Town. Okay, sure. Alright, we've got some Embryum. Just here. I'm sure we won't use that for crafting anything because I never do it. Always forget. Boom. Oh, that was a good multi-hit. Tell me they don't get reinforcements. This was a, a couple of slate. Oh my god, they do. You do forget that just... Literally, there's always reinforcements in this game. I, I did point it out, like, when we first did the docks. But you just forget that it's, it is actually all of them. Like, everybody gets reinforcements. Every battle involves one more group of enemies, maybe two. It's, it's fun the first couple of times, because they trick you into a false sense of security, you know, they, they give you the easy enemies and you're like, oh, this was crap. And then suddenly there's like twice as many. But when it gets to the point where it's every battle, <clears throat> like these guys are not particularly easy. So there's just going to be more reinforcements. I assume Fenris has got that handled up there. Yep. Oh, he does do a lot of damage, huh? And here's the reinforcements. You. Mage. Oop, don't even think about it. I can keep you stunlocked most of the day. Okay, I can't stop that. <clears throat> There we go. Woof. <laughs> okay, well, Fenris definitely dealt with that one. I get the feeling Fenris is just kind of better than me. I think it's his stance, his, like, delirium ghost stance or whatever it is. Because it, like, adds extra spirit damage to every attack or something, right? Uh... Lyrium Ghost. Better crit chance, that's what it does. Yeah, it's just way better crit chance. Well, way better. 20%. Oh, and inverse proportion of health damage goes up. Right, so the more damaged he is. He's a classic berserker. Fuck. Oh, right, I've got the thing. Wow, strength plus 1, health plus 20. Ooh, so fancy. So fancy. Uh, what's his stats, though? Strength 33, damage 64, 44. Why? Why is his... Oh, wait, is it his sword? 28 physical damage? 18, yeah, that's, that's what it is. His sword's, like, way better than mine. By a factor of, what, nearly two? A little bit less. Uh, Isabella. Complex chest. Love your work. Moving on. I guess we're supposed to go in here. That explains why all the boys came out. Ooh. Plus there's another chest. Oh god, I can't get that either. Isabella. You're a pirate. Give. Yep. Uh, is that shield any good for me? Nope. It's an enchanter's cap. Uh, you can't wear it, right? No, they can't wear armor. Gotcha. They have their own armor. Always forget about that. I always just think it's like their, their chest plate. 
There were many such holdings once, especially in the mountains where individual slavers kept private pens. They were designed to protect against raids by fellow slavers. No doubt it's why Hadriana chose this place. Raids by fellow slavers. Do slavers attack each other often? Probably. They did. What better way to find slaves than to steal them? That's right. Don't have to enslave them that way. They're already enslaved. Have mostly been abandoned, but they still exist. Uh, we have nothing to fear. A few protections won't stop us. Let's hope this isn't a waste of time. Ah, sure we'll be fine. Let's go. Oh, just have to take Fenris. Well, we just do the same same team. All right, but actually, we might leave this episode here, I think. This looks like the perfect place to stop. So, guys, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you want to see more content from me, the Aussie Nerd, feel free to subscribe to my channel and check out the other videos on there. If you think you're only friends of mine who enjoy my content, make sure you share the video too with them. Really appreciate it. And finally, if you want to leave any hints, tips, tricks, feedback for the videos, or you just want to say hi, make sure you do so in the comment section down below so I can see it. I'll see all of you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.